Hi, welcome. This is my easy plant pot hack. I need to repot this plant, so I decided to show you it. I've just looked at the roots. If you turn it over like this, you can see if there's any roots coming out the bottom. Obviously, there's only a little tiny one there, but I just still need to repot it. So, I'm going to wash this and then we're going to stick them together. So that's a bigger pot than the other one. So this will be my top plant. No, sorry, this will be my top pot. <laughs> so I've glued them together and now I'm going to paint them. I watered down what was left in the paint pot and splashed it on. I've speeded it up so it should be pretty quick. Um, I didn't really want to sit here and bore you. But I just wanted to show you how easy it is to make your own, your own hack, your own plant pot stand. You know, this is all the rage at the moment. I was going to paint it gold, spray it gold to be honest with you, but I decided to go with this colour because this is the colour I've used in my bathroom and I've used it a lot in my house too. I really like it. It's actually called Teal. Teal. T-E-A-L. I will put it on the screen. So, painting it all over, leaving it to dry, and then literally giving it another little paint. It's literally just about emulsion, okay? Don't use gloss or anything like that. This is just pure emulsion. Pots were clean, pots were dry before I painted them. And I think you'll see it's worth it. I painted all around the lid and inside as well as far down as I knew that, well, just as far down as the first part of the lid. And um, I think it worked perfectly. Love this colour. What do you reckon? I'd like to hear your comments down below. So, just bear with me and we'll get to the end of this. But why spend all this money on all these pots that they're charging a fortune for? When you can make such easy things. I mean, this was so simple. I literally spent some time in the afternoon painting the pot and just like taking my time. I just popped in every now, every now and then and give it a little, another little paint and touched it up. And then in the morning when I come back down, I decided to give it another little paint as there was a few little spots. But this is my kind of my second coat. I just sort of give it another little flick over, make sure I haven't missed anything. And then um, I'm done. Zoomed in a little bit so you can have a little look. I think it's a great colour. And just so you can see just inside. So just, I will come back and just give it a little paint around in the places that I might have missed or just not covered very well. That was worth it. bit of paint here and a little bit of paint there and it's sorted how quick I mean I know I speeded it up but I'm I'm quite a quick painter anyway but it was just so quick and so easy and you know what I think I paid something like two pounds or something for that top the top pot the big one the bottom one I paid about ten or four because I paid for it because I wanted pink at the time but don't throw them away reuse them stick them together and lift the plant from the ground is so good and you'll be surprised how lovely your plant will it will just look lovely you will appreciate it really appreciate it trust me so after i'd painted it and it had dried i turned it and then obviously there was bits that i noticed that i hadn't completely covered so i just went over it and um, yeah, it's really, really therapeutic to be honest with you. I really did actually get a lot from doing this. I really love, love the outcome. I love it. <laughs> you can paint so many different things. You can see this is a second coat now. This is like, you can see the little 
bits that are not painted and then as I paint them it's definitely um, went a long way because I let my brush be a little bit wet, left it a bit wet because I just left it in water and then I mean as a tip you can actually just wrap your your used brush in a plastic bag. Yes, I'm Great. liking it. I'm really liking it. <clears throat> so I've put my um, twine around it and you have to remember to push each bit, bit down or what happens is you end up running over the top of it. So I just started twisting it round and I found it easier that way. So I just turned it and I kept it nice and tight but I actually like the effect of it slightly coming through. I don't know if you can see what I mean. But I just used the hot glue gun in just odd places. I didn't use it like all the time. I made sure I just wrapped it a bit and then I glued it on. And uh, the, I don't know if you can see the effect, but it's really nice. I'm really happy with it. I'm not going to go right to the top because I've got some beautiful gems that I'm going to stick on there. Um, just to sh so it doesn't show that little bit that needs covering where they're joined together. Um, I am denied quite a bit over it, what I was going to do. But... I sort of went with it, with my gut, and just tried different things. Trying different, trying different things, and it worked. It really, really worked. But you see what I mean? You've got to push it down. There we go. I love it. It's all about upcycling, you know, these days. There's so many different types of things that you can find. Just go on YouTube and type in upcycle pop or whatever it is, tutorial, whatever it is. And just try things, give it a go, just, just watch something and see if you can do it. See if you can create it. And it, honestly, sorry, I should get rid of that bit where it says whistle. Um, yeah, I had to do a voice over this video because Ziggy was just so uh, noisy and it was unbearable. So I just couldn't find a minute's peace with him. So it's late now. So I'm having to record this a bit, a bit late. And we're about there, I think. Are we about there? I think it's looking great anyway. Can't wait to finish it now. You get to that stage where you're like, oh, where, 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 what bit should I do next? And how can I explore this? Right, I'm going to stick these little gems on it. Oh, <laughs> a bit tangled up. That's it. Jump. Right, decided to stick these little gems on, so I'm going to do them at the top here first, I think. I'll push the glue back in. Just a little tiny dollop will do. I'm going to stick them around the top. Like it, I like it, I like it. Do you like it? What do you think? I've been sort of pondering over what to do with it. Um, I had the plant standing on top of the other plant pot. Obviously, the bottom one was pink, and then the top one was black. Um, B and M selling the black ones, the top one that I've got for cheap money at the minute. So I thought, okay, I'm going to use them as the planter. 
on top of the old pot, um, which is exactly what I've done. And I thought, if I decorate the bottom one, this will um, create the illusion of a stand, I think. And that was my idea anyway, sorry about the noise. Okay, and these are so cheap to buy. That's it, so simple. And you'd probably spend a fortune buying these, uh, buying a plant pot like this. Why, when you can make something so cute yourself? It's, um, it's a shame. People should experiment a lot more. It's so good for your mind to work it out and oh, look at that that's just beautiful I love it I really do I love it now I, I was I went in our in so much about the beads should I put them on should I not and I think this is just finishing it off lovely glue stuck to my fingers I love this glue it sticks to your fingers right and it's like that stuff that when you pull it off it's like a satisfying feeling I mean I've got the glue gun on low It. I think it gives it depth anyway, seeing a little bit of the green through it, don't you think? Um, I'd like you to pop your comments, um, give me a little comment, what you think, what you think of my video, if you think I should have done something else, so it's not boiling, it's hot, so here we go. There's a little tiny gap there, but never mind. Right over there. Yep. Over there. I really, really like it. And I really think I might have to put some more of them on. What do you think? I'm really not sure if I just want to leave it like that. I think I need a little bit more bling. I have got these. I have got these, so I could putting some of them on.